What's up guys? It's been a year since you've seen this. A full year. This is now Lego Camping Setup Part 5. There's five phases of these. So, well let's get to it. First you have the truck. Wow, it really looks good at that angle. I'm going to make that the thumbnail. I'm going to get that shot right there, the thumbnail. That looks dope. Okay, so let's get started. Truck, nothing's changed. Um, in the back, you have kind of a big grill. I might size that down to minifigure size because that looks huge. Uh, I got my doll in the bed of the truck, too. Just a nice little add-on. So, yeah, there's the dog. Now, let's get into this because there's been a lot done since you've seen it. So, extended by a lot. It's been extended by eight, eight studs. Just about eight studs or nine studs because stock... It'd be right here. That's it. This would be the rear. So I extended quite a bit because here's three and here's so maybe about six, seven studs long, longer. Um, nothing changed back here. Still got the dirt bikes mounted up to the back of the trailer. I did get a satellite and air conditioner to, I don't know, just part of the air conditioner. And that's it. Now let's get into the inside because this thing is way bigger now so I actually did not <coughs> think anything would fall you got a sink I made that myself you got your stove and then you got a cabinet um, if you remember it came with a coffee maker that's not there got two three people four people and then you have, actually, oh, my TV, my TV fell from the roof. I have this ceiling mounted TV. Um, I'm going to have to put that back on. I'm surprised it did that, but yeah, couch, TV, a remote for the TV, somewhere, uh, a little minifigure laying on the couch while they go to the camping spot. I'm gonna put that TV back on. That I'm looking at it because that sucks that it fell. I don't know why. You think it doesn't? Put that back on. You see? No, nope, it fell off again. That's really weird. And this is all of a sudden. I didn't think it would start falling off. Uh, it could be this little baby minifigure that's making it fall. Sorry, guys. I know you don't like seeing the black screen, but I'm trying to get this. Okay. TV's back on. I put the baby in the camp or, or in the upper part of the bed. Got your clock. That's different. Um, if you notice, two doors. I have two doors now. And that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to have two doors to make it way longer. Oh, and the awning is new too. I will flip this setup around and show you what this is about. So let me do that real quick. I have to disconnect the second trailer real quick. Sorry, I'm putting it down again. Extended three trailers. Okay. So we got a better view 
now. So here's the two doors. This awning is brand new. It's only been on for about a week. So that's new. Um, I wish it was bigger, but it is what it is now. I wish it could go across the whole thing. That would be cool. But yeah, got double doors. Now let's move on to the second trailer. It's extended. It would end right here. So I only went about two studs back. Uh, new trailer wheels for both of them before they add like off-road trailers or wheels tires and then back here you got your pedal bike soon to be mounted right there in front of the bed you got your four-wheeler that front bumper is custom i did that on my own and then this is the new buggy i think i don't think you've seen this before but this is the new buggy I had that sand dunes type buggy, it was blue, but um, it fell apart and I don't exactly remember how to put it back on. I, if I could figure that out, then it'll go back on, but this is the new buggy. Got custom bumper, it's got a big fuel tank or a fuel jug for other just a big dune buggy or sand buggy um hopefully one day i can make an actual side by side but yeah that is it for this video thank you for watching yet again um that's it so uh see you guys